Launched in January this year, the single African air transport market was hailed as a long-awaited solution to the low-level growth of intra-African air transport. Currently, intra-Africa air transport accounts for less than 20% of all air transport on the continent, compared to more than 50% for Europe. Out of the 28 members of the single African air transport agreement, only 14 have committed to liberalize their skies. In a slow process for some countries in their national legislation to, 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 to approve the, the signing of the, the agreement. So we're confident that you know, by the end of, say, 2019, we should have a lot of those countries, the 44 countries on board on this agreement. So we, we, we're not feeling that countries are reluctant to join. But we believe that it's a question of process. But there, I mean, I would also try to argue the case for some small countries or countries with weak airline, which want to see that there are some guarantees that in joining the market, their, their, their national airlines will not disappear. African Union Director of Air Transport, Goe Ndor, says other 14 countries are at various stages of ratifying the single African transport market charter due to strict legal requirements. Among the 14 countries that are yet to sign the charter is Kenya, which is reviewing its air transport regulations. The 27 countries that have signed the single African air transport market represent 80% of the passenger traffic in Africa. As we are going forward, as the economies of Africa are developing, you saw in the slides presented by Ayata that in the next 10, 20 years, Africa is the fastest growing region in the world in terms of aviation. So as our economies improve, so people also, the propensity to, fl to fly would increase. People's income would increase and people to fly. So the African economies need to do better so that it could enable people to have the, the necessary income to, 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 to go around. The African Union is engaging with various heads of state in a bid to hasten the ratifying process. Boy spoke on the sidelines of the International Civil Aviation Air Services Agreement negotiations. The five-day meeting comes to an end tomorrow.